Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Thaumaturge. I think everything should be okay. I'm looking at OBS. It seems like... Why is, it... Why is the game audio so low on there? Sir, speak. Okay, it's it's got a little bit of a spike. Maybe it's just uh, where I am at, where I am at right now. Um, I got my my hutch put back on my desk, so I had to unplug everything, including my Go XLR Mini. So uh, everything I see levels on OBS. So it didn't default like it did before. So hopefully, everything is okay. I'm gonna assume it is. See that little ghost? See that little ghosting it did? And then it stopped. Whatever. Hello, sir. I wanted to send two telegrams. One to Warsaw and one to Paris. Mr. Shulsky, I was meant to send for you when the driver came to get the mail. My condolences about your father. Do you still want to send something? <sighs> Did you come to say goodbye to me? More like to share my fear. Your condition yesterday, after the fight with that... Bukovac, he troubled me. I don't think my treatments are having a long-lasting effect. And you don't look the best. Do you feel all right? Rasputin's like our best friend. Um, let's be honest with him. I've just heard that my father is dead. My condolences. I'm just gonna leave After the mouse wherever the fuck. When I was hallucinating, I saw him. I heard his voice for the first time in years. I'm sure it was him. A strange feeling. Maybe he came to say goodbye. Maybe it was his last chance to speak to you. A prophecy. I hope not. What do you intend to do now? I have to bury my father in Warsaw. Hmm. What about you? Thanks to you. I don't think I have anything else to do here. I had a little time to think about what I saw in your mind. Tell me, Victor. Have you ever seen a human skull cracked open on the cobblestones? It's a... That is a very strange question. I haven't. I have. The skull of Franz Ferdinand himself, with his brain spilling out. The Archduke? The I also saw the white steps in Odessa running with blood. A battlefield blanketed in lethal fog, with faceless beings emerging from it. This hasn't happened yet, but I saw it as clearly as I see you now. Thanks to you, I know that I can stop it. I know that I am part of history, and I can change it. Even at the cost of scorn, contempt, or my life. You promised me a favor, so Warsaw sounds perfect. So Rasputin is our confidant now, yeah? Persona-wise? This video might serve as a test video to make sure I didn't fuck up on anything, <laughs> to be honest. It doesn't look like I did, but I still, like, I have that feeling. Also, we just finished the prologue. Awesome. I thought that was a cutscene.
Warszawa! Warszaw! Warsaw! Ah, stop, Warsaw! Time to wake up! It's clouding over. The weather is like my mood. Aside from the circumstances of the funeral bringing you back, you hadn't thought of ever returning here? Hmm. I hate this city. It always makes me think of the stench of vodka, sweat, and urine. Corruption, poverty, and trust me, no justice but street justice. I'm sure something must have changed since you left. But probably not for the better. What about the people? Those close to you? You never miss them? I definitely didn't expect I'd be coming to my father's funeral so early. I've noticed you two had certain differences in your views on life. Yes, especially on my life. But admittedly, that's not a very exciting discovery. Is that all you've learned about me on our journey? You drool in your sleep. Anything in there about Warsaw? Workers are striking. They want to take advantage of the Tsar's visit to Warsaw. The protests are being violently suppressed. Last week, around a dozen people were killed. Polish Socialist Party militants attacked a train. They stole money, bonds, and explosive materials. They're also suspected of robbing a transport of Dutch bombers. The socialists in Warsaw must look pretty sharp then. Further along, we've got murders, muggings, and poverty. The newspapers feed on sensation. Remember that in darkness, even a small spark can be seen clearly. Even I can feel hope from all the people riding with us. Can't you? Not really. Even without my powers, I can tell that hope is bringing people here from all three partitions. Miners, steelworkers, governesses, maids, speculators, thieves. I've gotten to read a few of our fellow passengers' possessions, and I know that hope can have many faces. Will you share that knowledge with me? There's a terrified woman riding with us. She's either running away or in hiding. I think that gentleman is smuggling something, because excitement is all mixed up with guilt inside him. In this dandy, he's going whoring. If there's something I've learned in life, Victor, it's never to neglect the whores. Amen. Warsaw, end of the line. Welcome to Warsaw. I think the time's come to ask where you plan to stay. I will let you know when I come up with something. He's going whoring too, I suppose. All right, Warsaw, September seventh, nineteen oh five. Cool. Cool. Go to your father's funeral at Pel Pel Cemetery. Okay. Where? Ah, oh, yes. So E and right click are both the same thing. Okay. My cough, my cough caught up to me. 
I don't need to read the paper. We just read it on the train. What is, what is this? It's a leaflet. Brothers, the 11 hour work days are killing us. It's probably true. Let's follow the example of the workers in German and English factories and fight to reduce them to nine working hours. Join the strike, put down your tools, and join the fight for our future. Okay. It's currently 1 a.m. This is probably not the right game for me to play tonight. I'm so sleepy. Uh. Oh, okay. That's a menu. Excuse me, good sir. What is this thing? Uh. Is that a child? Those exist here? I, is it a waiter? It looks like he's wearing a little waiter clothes. I swear, is that the only child in here? It's the only one I saw. There's another one. It's the exact same one, though. That's the exact same child. anti thaumaturge leaflets? Who wrote this shit? Let's protect our children, get rid of these parasites? Oh yeah, I get experience from reading. Okay. I'm sleepy as fuck, <laughs> so I'm gonna peruse. Just so I can get my, my little, my little nip of XP. That's a new child, I think. What, that's an adult! That, that person has a beard! Maybe, maybe that's a child. If anything, it, it's Woody from Toy Story. Okay, I gotta, I gotta. Alright. So I can get this now. Action, reaction. Yeah, but what, it, what else does it do? What else does this do? See, my Salator doesn't really do much attack. Unless that one's also in the party. Do I do I only get one to fight with, or... I'm not sure. Part of me feels like upgrading uh, the Deed, just so I can start upgrading uh, the Bukovac. The Bukovac. Sorry. I don't know how quickly I'll get them. Um, oh, I think I just hit the mic with my shoulder. Um, I have another idea, though. What if I just don't do it? What if I don't upgrade until I see something that I might need to upgrade for, you know? I think I can handle a few fights without needing to upgrade. The city that does not forget. Okay. It's weird for a city to do. I don't fully understand, but I support it. Why such a crowd? The circus has come to town. These are troubled times. How could he focus on the circus with her standing next to him, you know? <laughs> Russia has had enough bloodshed. The violence must stop. When socialists attempt to divide Russia and her subject nations, to dent the sword that smote the enemy at Grunwald, this demands my decisive action. Thus, by my grace, I hereby appoint as Governor General of Warsaw, Georgi Antonovich Skawon. A butcher. I agree. Not a popular guy, I presume. I see you ain't from here. That swine keeps a photo album of all the folks he's had shot at the Citadel. Before and after execution. Warsaw! The time for leniency and indulgence is over! 
From the moment this office is bestowed on me, all forces hostile to the subjects of Greater Russia will have any further right to exist. None? Whether it be brutal socialist subversives, communists, Jews, or other satanic provocateurs. Uh, I don't agree. Who knows how to unite a crowd? Pardon me. Are you Polish? Yes, I feel Polish. My name's Victor. Vanda. Vanda. Is this Russia here? Like it or not? Warsaw! Premia Terora! Zakonjlois! Idi na chuj! My first decision as Governor General of Warsaw. Arrestovat. We shouldn't stand next to this guy. Great heroes and their sense of timing. Of course, now they're the first ones in the fight. We want that rebel. The Lautmau. Damn. What happened? Be a gentleman. Please kneel and tie my shoe. Okay. I didn't dare of course. Myself. Can I ask you a tiny favor? The Russians can't find out about this. Where are they the falling from? The is just looking for an excuse to suppress the crowd. And these workers are dreaming of thrashing a Russian gendarme. Either one of you confesses to disturbing the peace, or of Sieg Zabirai. We'll take you all in. They don't know who did it? All of us. Can you get us out of here? I think I'm open to any kind of suggestion. With a book like that, I find out what would convince one of these bastards to let us go. You want me to fight? Or I take on that self-appointed leader of the proletariat. Interesting strategy. Who are you, really? A damsel in distress. Those don't usually hide ammunition in their stockings. Can I explain it to you another time? I don't want to say I could have handed her in. That would make her distrust me just a tiny bit. I'm going to take a look around. I'll take a look around. Um, Wanda, whom I met during the cattling incident, needs me to help her inconspicuously escape. Understood. Um, pistol bullets. Small bullets carry big emotions. Hope, because they are meant to benefit the cause. Fear, which in these difficult times makes its way to even the hardiest of hearts. And determination, the companion of courage, without which it would be impossible to face reality. Each bullet was hidden in the nooks and crannies of the undergarments with care and precision. And just like the previous time and the time before that. This is nothing new for a person who took the risk. Okay. Just in case. Wait, they seriously can't get the actual guy who did it? <laughs> it seemed pretty evident who it was. Do you think it's a good idea to stir people up and send them to face bullets and bayonets? What do you want then? Is that guy behind you? My knees, kissing Ruski's ass. I mean, that would get us XP, right? I don't know. I feel like this ends with us getting shot if we fight. But I like to fight. I was trying to keep from dragging ordinary people into the fight. They won't expect us to strike first. How many are coming with us? Let's see for ourselves. Thought that was someone else whistling, to be honest. Oh, two of us. Okay. 
Okay, I don't I don't want to level up just yet. Um Every attack on the enemy deal maximum. Mm. That gives us 60% chance of dealing double, or we could always do 14. Let's go with this one for a bit. Let's put a fortune here. Or not. I thought it could have more than one. Oh well. Okay, that's. Alright. That's fine. Selecting yourself a Selator. You can preview both you and your Salter skills. This will help you prepare your attack. <coughs> Shit. You can summon another at any time. A green frame around the Salter's image means they are exceptionally effective in a fight with a given enemy. So I need to pick the green one. Read the description above the Salter to find out why they will be useful. Okay. Okay, so he... So I do need him. Focus deprivation will be more effective against the enemy. Sure, but you're right. Um, Oh shit! Oh. Nice. What about my companion? What's he- oh. What's- what's- what's my companion gonna do? Uh, suffering for five rounds receives uh, three to four damage at the end of every round. I really should have just gave that to this one, huh? And let this be the. Uh... Ah. I mean, this is this is him, right? This guy's gonna act next. Our buddy's actually gonna act next, but who is he gonna attack? It won't really matter. We can just use this on him. We can start lowering his focus. Ah. Okay. Our friend takes forever to throw a punch. Uh This won't really matter. Um, my focus is fine. How do I actually, how do I use my focus? The enemy is not in breakdown. Okay, so use my focus. I need to, I need to break that. Uh, fuck it. Let's try to, how much is that going to reduce? Just one? Yeah, it looks like it's just one. Fuck it. Let's reduce his focus by two. I'll do this, and then I'll have him uh, give us 10 HP.
Wait, did I do the scar one or the fucking focus one? Okay, he's fucked up. Oh shit. Uh, enemies can have a trait that makes them immune to your attacks. Traits are related to different dimensions and they can be disabled. To disable an enemy's trait attack, uh, to, to disable an enemy's trait, attack them with a salutor that belongs to the same dimension as the trait. Note that you, uh, you don't have to have the required dimension force, you can take away all the opponent's focus and launch a strong attack. Okay, it's got a lot of focus. Oh, attack with Upir disable. Okay. Um, I'll do that, and then uh, do that. Why am I always getting attacked here? Never mind. Ah. Oh fuck, is it because I shot that man? Name. Why'd you take my revolver? Victor. One of those Shulskis? Yes. My condolences. Now, profile. Thank you. And thus our journey comes to an end. What you pissing in the bucket for, asshole? Where else am I supposed to? Brown in the bucket, whiz on the wall. Better remember that too. That bucket's gonna last you guys till tomorrow. Can I use the phone? So she ended up getting arrested? Okay. I got some experience for that, even though I've already. Let's talk to Wise Guy. What are you staring at, Gannon? I don't know if that's I racist. I don't know what that means. Quit squealing. First time in the big city? Have some respect if you don't know who you're running your mouth at. He's one of them that went after the Ruskies with his bare fists. And a gun. And a gun. Um. What fucking... Uh, was that the peaceful path? Uh, I'm just gonna say I'm innocent. For being innocent. Same as all of us. Well, are you from somebody? My name's Viktor Shulski. I don't think we should be telling everyone we're a thaumaturge. Uh, just right. saying. Respect. First of all, I am a thaumaturge. Never mind. Now them, I got respect for. I know one really decent Jew from Povishla who's a wizard too. How about you? You got a foreskin or what? Is my foreskin any of your fucking business? Well, no. I, I was just... You got a foreskin or what? Hold on, I gotta write that one down. But you don't look like much of a Warsaw lad. <sighs> got a marker. Uh, you... Got a... Foreskin... <laughs> or... What? Okay, cool. I'll remember that one for later. Um, what? I'm just here for my father's funeral. 
I hope you don't miss the funeral toast. Welcome to Warsaw. Who, wh where's the guy who was fighting alongside me? It wasn't him, was it? That's just a bald man, I believe. I wouldn't call you a master strategist. You got away from the station, so theoretically, we achieved our goal. You're not losing your sense of humor. I guess this isn't your first time in a place like this, is it? You better tell me if you managed to get rid of your ammunition. If I hadn't, I'd already be locked up at the Citadel. I admit your behavior did successfully distract the Ruskies. You're welcome. All right, then. What's such a gorgeous, hairy mug doing in a crummy place like this? I am curious about who she is. We've got a little time to kill. Maybe now you can tell me more about yourself. You seem to know your way around this setting. You been here often? I'll take that as a compliment. And sure, sometimes, if the cause demands it. What cause? Let's say I know certain folks who'd find polls like you useful. Dealers in stolen Dutch pomade? Donut connoisseurs. They met at Burke Rotblitz's cafe. I don't want to jinx it, but do you spend time there too? If I'm not there, no one will want to talk to you. And don't worry, I don't usually hang out long in places like this. Shulsky. I see you won't be hanging out here long either. Another meeting. Fearless Vanda, the smuggler of bullets, proposed a meeting at Burke Rot Blitzes. What's our conclusion? The woman I met during the kettling incident was smuggling bullets in the nooks and crannies of her undergarments. Clearly it wasn't the first time she's done that. Unfortunately, this time the garter didn't hold and the bullets fell onto the pavement. Maybe fate will have us cross paths again and we'll meet at Burke Rot Blitzes for jam donuts. Nice. Jolski, this yours. That's right. Then take it and get out of here. Where's my gun? I do. I'm curious. Can I ask why the sudden change of plans. Anyone I should thank? If he wants to, he'll tell you himself. Thank you. I feel like I feel like our guy here is a is a talker, you know. Even though we did just execute a man, got our gun back. Okay. That's my file. <laughs> All right. Why they just leave that out? Excuse me while I read your cop stuff. It's on this file. Can I just... Can I just read that? Where would that be? I have clothes? The hell? Uh... I'm missing quite a few of those. Oh, never mind. We can't read it, but we can uh, we can spend a point on something, huh? I feel like I should get the Bukovaches, you know, good to go. Action reaction. I just it's an additional skill. Wait, wait. That's what I was using, right? Skill additionally casts a state on a random enemy? Was I not using that? I don't think I was. This buffs the next attack. 
makes you lose focus. This could be incredibly useful since, uh, I don't really use focus too much. The 4 to 1 ratio. That'd make me lose quite a bit of focus, wouldn't it? Okay. I do feel as if, like, if I get these filled out, I can just focus on, on these. And I'm starting to slowly lose my voice, which is, uh, a little fucked up. It is 1.30, and I have been moving around all day. I am quite tired. So I'll probably do this, and I'll wrap it up. Then I'll edit the video and make sure I didn't fuck anything up, because if I did, it's going to be quite annoying. Honestly, I could just say fuck it and spin them both. Uh, that's gonna cost two, okay. Increases inflicted damage. So I could like buff myself with that and then use a skill that has like the maximum output or the 60%. Hmm, that could be. Looks to be some interesting combos. Go ahead and get this one. Alright. Let's get some more XP real quick. Um... I... I'm not pronouncing that name. ABBA. That's who he is. Wanted list Maria, 54. Jeff? Nerd? That's what his name is. Nothing else. Anything else I can pretend to read? A note? Juice? Thalma Churches? Okay, fucked up. Can I take your food? No? Too old for this shit. I'm sounding too old for this shit. <laughs> I can't talk this much. Fuck. <laughs> Read. Maybe I should drink some water. Read everything. Don't go over there. It's personal space. Stanley. Or Stanislaw. Close enough. We're almost leveling up just by reading shit in the fucking PD. Is there... I don't think there's enough for one more level up. It's okay, though. I'll end here. And, uh, what is... The fuck? Oh, they're conclusions. Oh. Vanda. Okay, these... Oh, this was the murderer. I'm not infallible, it was certain Luca had the flaw. Vesna killed her violent father, seeing no other way to save herself. See, I didn't get all that, because we kind of just left. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end it, end it here. This is a very cool game, and I'd much rather play it when I'm not uh, about to pass out and go to sleep. <laughs> it's a lot of reading. But uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.